window here you just click product as you click the product we have new product and you have a uh, record in this case i need to use a uh, record in this case i need to come here now i put the record the, my, my list of record here as you can see we have some of the list here which here and in this case i need to add more record i can just come here p4 p4 product zero zero then i can put for example zero six there then i come here i choose stock item i choose the name of my product for example i need laptop uh, we have the laptop uh, call i5 uh, with 500 uh, hard disk drive hard disk drive uh, with 500 GB hard disk drive uh, 8 GB RAM and 15 inch uh, screen screen once I put that one, uh, then from there I can come here, I put, uh, for example, it is made in uh, India, uh, made in Japan. And now I can come here, don't quite to put weight, I just come here, I put the barcode here for this uh, laptop. Uh, laptop. Uh, for this laptop, uh, the device I will put the laptop itself is about uh, for example uh, hp a laptop so here you can come you put laptop you put that kind of a number for the barcode there uh, and that there you can come here you put this one which is the tax code 16 percent for that tax code and now you can put the selling price for example it has been sold at five thousand Kenya shillings uh, once you put uh, that that if five uh, thousand uh, as one unit that is means is one sold as one item and you have now the cost of place I need to come to in stock I click yes then I come here the reference number I come I put the same reference number P06 as uh, from which date I can come here I put my product as far as that date no problem then I can come here I put the quantity on hand that is quantity on hand you can put for example 15 of them and now the cost price of each one of them it is uh, 32,500 2500 and from there I click save this is how you see and this cost price you come here and this is the selling price I can come here we have the order level and you have the order quantity I put a order level of a order quantity of three uh, that one is okay that's how you feed the main product and you just click save and you click uh, close or you just come here you add another one P zero zero six uh, you can see it's there you put seven and then we have the stock item now here we have the description as for this description we have about um, uh, about uh, SATA SATA uh, uh, we have uh, one terabyte uh, one terabyte hard disk drive uh, we have this as now can just come here put Japan we have uh, can put that one as a barcode uh, then you have the cost price for this one is uh, we have the selling place is 7800 or just 8000 as one item and you have the cost price here you can put yes 
you come here you put uh, P00 7 uh, then you can put now the item here we have quantity on hand we have for example 23 of them and you have the caustic price which is 6500 and you have save once you put save you can come here put for example 5 at the reorder point then you click save and close that is how you can see now we have this list of products here we have the list of those products for example that one is the one you have added and you have added even that one among others you can see we have a list of items there you can see there all those are list of items and these are services also have to be added in this case that's our list of products as you can see there which you can work with it without no problem that is how you work and that's how you feed the product which